This HAN Network video is brought to you by Carl Chevrolet. This young man's been playing soccer since he was two. We'll let him introduce himself to you. He's one of the captains. There will be another one, but he is one of the captains of the boys' soccer team here at Granch High School with me. I'm Rob Adams. Tell us who you are. I'm Nick Bartles. Nick, uh, what got you involved at the age of two? And tell me about your passion for the beautiful game. Um, my dad played in high school, and he introduced it to me. Um, and the local rec league in town, that's when I all started. And, uh, yeah, loved it ever since I started picking it up. And I've been playing ever since I was two. Again, another interview in which I talk about the standard of excellence in the Cardinal programs and the soccer team, no different. It's become a powerhouse, a 2013 FCAC championship, and yet 2014, you guys have a lot of losses to graduation, but you still keep it together. Tell me about that. Well, we knew that we were a strong program and that the mentality had to be no matter how many people we lost, we got to come in and work hard, and that's what we did. Everyone gave it their all last year. Everyone was a really hard worker, and that's how you know that's how you go far and make a make a postseason run. In the FCAC. It's all about hard work and how much you're pressuring other teams on the ball, and it's it's how you can make another team uncomfortable, and that's how you usually come out with a win. 29 goals last year. Uh, do you think, in terms of there's a number of goals I need to score? You know, do you set a, a goal like that? No, I'm completely about winning. Yeah. I'd rather score 10 goals and win, and win an FCAC championship than score 29 and, and well, not even make the playoffs. I guess I'll ask it th this way. Is, in your mind, does 29 mean I'm doing my job, I'm doing the right thing, or can you distribute the ball and there are other guys who can pick it up from there? Completely, yeah. I mean, I'm fine doing either way. Um, I do think that I need to do my part, and I should be hitting a certain amount of goals every year, but I don't put any number right now, and I'm going through this season with a clear head of just trying to get the win and get the job done for this team. How about a moment about your coach? Love Kurt Putnam. He's a great guy. Uh, he's actually he's put me through his youth program since I was the age of five. I was with him from the age of five to 15. Last year I went to a competitive club team in New York, uh, New York Soccer Club, which I played in the spring, uh, which he understood, and that was for a recruiting aspect of getting more looks. But uh, I've been with him. It was great walking into my high school my high school career when I was a freshman and starting it all off with him. I love him. He's he's basically taught me everything I've ever known, and, and you know he really knows how to win and how to conduct a good a good team on and off the field. He's really you know he's a really smart guy in the way he thinks and, and the way he sets us up in good formations, and he really just prepares us for the highest level of play that we're going to be playing against. Before we know it, we'll be here for a soccer game when they take on the Wilton Warriors at 5 o'clock on Thursday the 17th. So we look forward to that. We thank Nick for joining us. We wish him and the Cardinals a lot of luck on the pitch, as they say, this year. So representing the boys' varsity soccer team with the Cardinals right here on the HAN Network at Greenwich High School.